What is up everybody? Headphones Neil here with an Android game review. So for today's game, it's going to be um, a game called Retro Shooter available for Android. I did a quick search and I didn't see that it's available for iOS, but I'm sure there's equivalent versions available. So the idea behind the game is very simple. It takes um, the shooter game, overview shooter games from like the original NES era and brings it to your mobile phone. So jumping into the settings you can toggle um, music settings and sound set effects and all of that you can tie the game to google play games so you can get achievements and um leaderboards and save your games across devices um hitting the market or a store get allows you to use your or buy additional ads things like removing ads getting extra lives extra diamonds or gems and things like that uh, touching your plane allows you to upgrade it. So as you gain gems, you can upgrade as main weapon attack, missile attack, magnetic uh, powers, and things like that. You can also add, get add-ons to your plane as you um, upgrade your, um, or as you progress through various levels and things like that. So um, there is that. So from there, it's very straightforward. Um, I will jump into a play game just to show off one of the levels and as you um, beat every level you um, get new levels so they become harder, faster you get different objectives that you need to complete um, and you have to you basically can do various upgrades from there. So hitting the play button allows you to uh, we'll, we'll start the level you'll get very t various tips and things like that as you go along so touching your finger to the screen will allow you to move your um plane around and as you can see the one the objective for this particular level is to complete it without getting shot by the enemy so in general you want to um, do that as well or not get shot to die but the idea is to be as perfect as possible because you will get additional um, gems in, in order to upgrade your plane as well. So um, one of the attacks that you can upgrade is the bomb attack. So if you find that you're getting overwhelmed by different uh, various enemies, then you can do exactly what I did to clear off the field and level it off a little bit so that you can... Um, make your attack and then you can also use this laser attack which much like the bombs um, gets replenished every so often as you progress through the level so there is a cooldown um, the bomb attack does get um, refreshed faster if you upgrade it as you go so that's one thing to keep in mind so if you are relying it on uh, relying on that bomb attack and um, you want to use it more effectively be sure to upgrade that as much as possible um, as you clear enemies, you will see that these random metals show up. And what that does is it allows you to upgrade your attack in level. So not only do you um, get your laser and bomb attack, you get that um, you get your main weapons um, upgraded as well. So the thing to do when you're playing the game is to uh, make sure you get those as much as soon as possible so that you can use it as effectively as possible in order to um, upgrade your, to defeat your enemies as efficiently as possible. So you see that you get the boss, which does get, you do get that summary over, um, when you just boss start so you know if it has a, how much of a defense and attack strength it has. And you can see that the, I accomplished my mission without getting shot, so I got an extra 150 gems. I earned 360 gems and I got bonus of 553 gems, so total coins of 1,070. Um, you can get additional gems by watching ads, I'm not going to in this case, but you'll see that now when I go to the main screen that um, I do, or you, I do have, um, the, or you do see a hand flashing over it, so when you do that, um, you'll see how many coins you have and, and um, that I can now upgrade um, various skills. So I'm going to upgrade my skill cooldown time. So I've done that. Um, and it looks like I have to clear stage 1-5 champion and 3 stars in order to get a sprout if I want this other stage. So for various upgrades, you do need to have uh, various upgrades. So um, I will try to just to see if this theory works clear stage 1-5 champion with three stars 
So I'm gonna go back, or I'm gonna go back to 1-5. It doesn't look like I got any stars. Um, so I actually have to pick, or I'll have to go back to my main level and go to 1-5 and see if I can beat it with uh, three gold stars. So let's give that a shot. Um, so yeah, the game has a lot of various different um, upgrades and add-ons and things that you can do in-game. Um, so it looks like the special mission is to use it without, finish the level without any special, uh, using my special weapons or anything like that. So I will give it a shot. Um, it looks like I have two stars, so meaning two lives. So I'm going to um, try and avoid the... Um, all of my enemies as much as possible just to see if I can get the extra bonuses as well um, so far so good um, but yeah it does take a little bit it doesn't take too long to get used to but the early levels are relatively easy as one would imagine and then you do have um, boss fight boss levels so you can you get extra um, bonuses by defeating them and um, going from there to um, play the levels as perfectly as possible. So, um, that's, and, but that's really the bulk of the game. But the one reason I like the game a lot is that, um, the game works with or without an internet connection. So if you do want to buy add-ons, that's where you would need your, um, internet connection. But for, um, as of right now, my phone is in airplane mode. So, and I am playing this game as smoothly as you see here. So, um, from what I could tell, you don't necessarily need, um, a high-end device because the graphics aren't particularly crazy as you can see. Um, from time, if you do have a lower end device, then you may need, um, then it might get sluggish, uh, here and there, but, um, beyond that, there isn't really thing, anything extra that the, um, game requires, so ha if you are in airplane mode, for example, you know that nothing else is working in the background, so, um, you shouldn't have very many issues as far as sluggishness or performance issues but of course higher end devices will perform that much better because you do have the extra um uh, resources for the game to work so i did finish the game i got my mission success for completing the game without um any um oh and i needed three stars to get the plane but i was able to finish it without any um extra resources so um there is that um but that's the bulk of the game. There's really not much else to say. It is a very fun game. So if you miss playing this on your console, then you can now play it on your Android device. So that is all there is for this particular game on per this particular review. So this is Retro Shooter available um, for free in the Google Play Store. You can get... Um, or you can pay for it or play the game without ads. Um, I feel like it was two ninety nine. So if you want to get rid of the ads, then there is that. But they are also not so intrusive that um, um, it gets annoying to play. At least for me, I never. I, they do pop up from time to time, but not so far. They haven't shown up for me in the middle of a game or during the um, during the boss fight. So there is uh, that bit of. Um, positivity there um but other than that i mean to uh complete the game and progress just remember to beat as the game as well as possible complete the various objectives collect as many gems as possible because the idea is to um, be able to upgrade your fighter or even get new fighters get the buff add-on so that um you can get that extra assistant if you so desire and once you get good enough with the game, I mean, the um, power-ups are optional, so the idea is to, um, um, I guess, play the game without the buffs, but um, they do definitely help if you so need it, um, especially in the later level. So as I mentioned earlier, make sure you upgrade your vehicle as much as possible. Um, but that's really it, the, and you can see the games, the... Um, background underneath the um, the plane, basically those islands and the sea level is dim, so you can see um, 
your fighter as well as you need to. So, and I'm probably not going to get anything special for this level because I did already die once. Um, so I'm just going to complete it. I'm not going to worry about the mission bonus or anything like that. Just to see if I can um, get the three stars this time. But I will try again later just to see if it's something that I can do. Or if it's something that doesn't really count because I died before the boss fight. But stage is clear. So let's see how well that works. Oh, and I got my three stars. So I will give it a shot as far as um, upgrading the plane. So let's close that out and let's click here. Um, require stage with three stars so I don't know if maybe I do need an internet connection but I will try that out later and the other thing is there is an achievement um, board so as you gather coins you can get um, extra coins for completing various achievements so be sure to check that out as well to get those um, coins as well but that is all for this particular review so if you want to get this review and all reviews um, early be sure to visit the patreon at patreon.com slash patel and zero one um, if you want to find me on twitter it's patel and zero one and all episodes end up on the website at patel and zero one.com and if you want to give a one-time donation rather than a monthly subscription that you can always visit paypal.me slash patel and zero one but that's all for this particular review. Thanks for tuning in, and until next time.